Hello, and thank you for deciding to become a dental assisting student. I'm very proud of you. My name is Tracy. I am the program director here at Brookline College for the Phoenix campus for the dental assisting program. Um, dental assisting is fun. That's all I can say right off the bat. I've been doing it for over 27 years. So it's always been a great career and I've always had a job and I've always had a lot of fun doing it. So you're on the right path. If you like working with people, if you have compassion for people and you're there to hold their hand and lead them to good dental health, you pick the right career. So in this program, first of all, we have a lot of fun. Um, right now with the COVID-19 going on, things are a little bit different. Normally I would be meeting you one-on-one um, -on -one to talk to you and try to get a little bit of an idea about why you picked dental and what you're looking to get out of this um, course. I know what I think you're gonna get out of it and what I feel like you're gonna need for your career, but I also wanna know what you think you need and what you think that the whole um, dental career field, what it is and why did you choose it? Because let's face it, for somebody to pick working in somebody's mouth all day long and working this far away from a doctor all day long, something's gotta be a little crazy. So. With that being said, we're a good group of people and we all stick together. There's a lot of dental assistants and a lot of people all working together to um, make dental health their priority, okay? I want you to know that going into this program, um, it's really a fun program. We learn a lot. It's a little bit different than the other programs here at Brookline, being that um, dental assisting you drop right into the core of what we're doing. So you don't go into a what's called Med A class first and, and then sprout out from there to your other programs. You're gonna drop right into dental. Your day one, we're gonna be talking about teeth. So with that being said, be ready. Um, first mod, it's always scary. And you're gonna notice that the other people in the class probably have more um, knowledge than you do because you're just starting out. And some of them already have a mod under their belt. So they already have five weeks under them. Other ones might be on their last mod. So they've already got six mods underneath them. So they've already been doing it for 30 weeks. So everybody's on a little bit different path. So don't be scared when you first come in. You're gonna get caught up. You're gonna get it figured out really quick. This group is really good at working together and helping each other. They all work together really well. I am here for you. It is my job to make sure that you are doing well in this class and I will do whatever I have to do to make sure that that happens. So if questions, comments, concerns, anything, I am here. I am an email away and I'll get that to you on day one. So don't you worry, okay? With that being said, also know that most of our curriculum now is based online. Um, we've gone to an ebook. Um, all of our assignments are done through the computer. So having a laptop is pretty important. You can access a lot of what we have from your phone. If you just want to use your phone, but it does make it more difficult. I'll just say that hands down. It's easier if you have a laptop, like I'm talking to you right now. So if you can get one, by all means, have one at your disposal, but you don't have to. It's just gonna be more difficult if you just try to use your phone. Also, as soon as we can get back into the classroom, we're going to. We just need this COVID-19 to get over with. And we can all go back to being social people, which dental people are, we're social. We enjoy being around each other. So as soon as that happens, we're gonna get back into a normal routine. Right now, our normal routine has been, um, we'll be lecturing. We do a live lecture every morning, well, Monday through Thursday at eight o'clock. I encourage you, especially being new students, to come into live lecture and listen to everybody. Listen to myself, my other instructors, so that we can get you through. There, um, the assignments are done through a program called Cengage, which you will um, make an account for. You will access um, Cengage and all your assignments through a platform called Moodle. Moodle is what we use here at the 
campus at the college to um, house all of your assignments and, and grades and all of that. So you'll have a Moodle access. When you access into Moodle, then you'll then click on a link that'll take you to Cengage. Cengage will ask you to um, make an account. And then once you've made that account with Cengage, you're gonna be good to go. You'll be able to access all your assignments through Cengage. What's great about Cengage is that you can open up your ebook on one side and your assignment on the other and just be able to do them right together. It's very user friendly. If you're in chapter, I don't know, 24, it'll tell you question number three is in 24.2. So it tells you right within the chapter where to find the answer that you're looking for. Very user friendly, it follows along. It's, it's really nice. Cengage is a new book for us. This will be, when you get here, the second mod that we've used it, but we're really enjoying it and having a good time with it. So just know that that's kind of how assignments work and what's gonna be expected of you. Lab time, with COVID-19 going on, a lot of things are up in the air and changing daily. Just know as soon as we can get back to the classroom, we are going back to the classroom because we have a beautiful dental lab that hopefully you got to see and we want to use it and we're going to get into it and use it as much as we can because we like to do things as much hands-on as we can. So just know that going forward, we're going to get into that lab, okay? Again, questions, comments, just make sure you get an email to me and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Try to keep up. If you feel like you're falling behind, let me know and let's work together. If you don't feel comfortable asking me, which I don't know why you wouldn't, but make sure you find friends within the class. They all work together really well. And the groups that come together and study together and work together are the groups that do the best. So I encourage you to make friends within this class and work together with them. Because like I said, everybody's at a little bit different stage of learning and being together is an amazing thing. All right. Other than that, be ready to have some fun. Dentistry is fun. No matter what your family or any of your friends might have said, it's a lot of fun and we're going to have a good time. So um, I look forward to seeing you first day of class on Monday, whenever that is. <laughs> I don't have the date in front of me, but we look forward to it and I hope you're ready. So have a good time and we will see you on Monday for first day. All right. Take care.